Martin is a former Harrier and Typhoon pilot on the front line. He's also instructed on the Hawk, and he's in his second year as the team leader. I'm trying to video this, so... In from the left-hand side, it's Short Diamond. On the right of Red 1 in Diamond is Red 2 Flight Lieutenant Damo Green. Damo has previously flown the Hawk on our aggressor squadron. He's also flown the Typhoon on the front line operationally, and he's in his first year on the Red Arrows. Red One using a very metronomic cadence when he talks to the other pilots on the radio. They're reacting to his voice rather than the movement of his aircraft to keep those formation shapes tight and symmetrical. Well, to the right hand side, you can see the aircraft moving. This formation represents the first of our anniversaries, which is, of course, the 50th anniversary of the Apollo moon landings. And in from the right hand side, calling the shape of the Apollo it's time for the Apollo roll. in his I'm first year on like the Red Arrows. I'm trying to get but them, you can't but I'm not see going right now. Now. I can see them. Oh, right out, right over there. I'm trying to get them. I, I can't, I, I can't see them. Red metronomic commands as the aircraft bank around to our left-hand side. The smoke comes back on. They're changing to the next of our historic formation positions. Representing the supersonic airliner designed in Great Britain and France that was so successful, had its 50th, or had its anniversary, its 50 years since its first flight this year. In from the left-hand side, Reds 8 and 9 will form the engines underneath the aircraft as it flies straight towards us before banking to the left. The nose lights are on towards us, the smoke is about to come on. In from the left-hand side, it's Concord. Dad, stay still for a second. <laughs> Smoke off go calls Red One as Concord disappears out to our front right. Well, the Dang it, I had it on there. there. I had it on there. This one, a very difficult I'm just going to show you guys. We have six aircraft all flying line abreast. Red six and seven. Guys, wait up. On the left of Red One in Phoenix is Red Three Squadron Leader Mike Bowden. Mike has previously flown the Harrier and the Tornado GL4. He's instructed on the Hawk before and is in his fifth season on the Red Arrows. In from the left hand side, the colored smoke about to come on for Phoenix. That's up. Red one as Phoenix moves 
that over to us. Look at that. All right. Well, we've seen two flight formations already. It's time for another one. It's crazy. This time it's the aircraft that was the mainstay of bombing operations in World War II for Bomber Command in the Royal Air Force. This is crazy. We have one of these aircraft still flying in the UK, operated by our Battle of Britain Memorial flight. It is, of course, the Lancaster. I can't see that. I'm trying to stay here. In from the right hand side, the nose lights will come on towards us, the smoke will come I'm on. I'm sorry, you guys, I can't see the that. Up, ready for the Lancaster roll. We don't know where they are. So, I guess it's a good time to um, talk to you guys. Oh, oh there they are. Guys, stop. Upside down at two and a half thousand feet, Lancaster cruises over the top of us. Now, many of you will think that Lancaster was a terabatic. Well, the great test pilot Alex Henshaw, who keeps you on Lancaster more than once, means testing them during the war in Great Britain. As Lancaster moves off to our left hand side, it's time for one of my favourite manoeuvres. This manoeuvre represents the combat aircraft that many of us on the team have flown. They retired from RAF service last year, having spent three decades flying combat operations. Reds 8 and 9 are about to move to the back of the formation. They'll drop back as the nose lights come round towards us. The air brakes will come out. The smoke will come on. The call will come for 8 and 9 to roll. It's time for Tornado. Dang it, I don't want to move. Camera ready, position on the left. Dang it, I can't see him. Okay. Alright, thanks. Yeah. Look at that. Isn't that sick? Yep. Stop, 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 that was like really Five cool. Fortune. Yeah, I know. I'm really excited to eat some food because I'm really hungry. So am I. There's a lot of free food at our town. So yeah, I know because we have uh, the VIP area. Yeah, we have the VIP. That's what we. That's what we're getting at Yogi Bear. That. Oh yeah, that. Oh, the limo thing. Yeah, the limo yeah. golf cup. We're getting that at Yogi Bear. I'll, I'll show you guys YouTube videos at Yogi Bear too. I'm gonna give you guys YouTube videos there. I'm not gonna be able to post them until I come back though. Unfortunately. We're good? Alright. I have no clue where they are. I'm sorry you guys, I can't see them at all. show we keep having to move we're in a bad angle right now too sorry guys
trying to get everything on camera because they keep splitting up. This is going to be one good YouTube video. What do you have to say about that, Dad? Did you say so? It's going to be one good YouTube video. I'm going to make a lot of them. Stupid freaking tents! God dang it! Another truck. Hey, baby. Huh, how are you? What the flip? Hi, the vlogger right here. Dang it! I can't. I need to grab a pack of Skittles and run. Let me grab a pack of Skittles. Hello, Tony. How are you doing? Good. I need to go. Let me move. Let me go watch the air show. Okay. Is this where we're sitting? Can I go out there and look? Go ahead, go ahead. Sorry, guys. Up through the middle goes Red 8. Coming hard. Right to the middle. 6 down. 7 stay in there with the cool and smoke on. Red 8 up through the middle is Fullerton and Chris Lincoln Smith. He's formally flown the tornado and instructed on the hawk. And has flown in the most number of positions of anyone on the Red Arrows. He's flown as 2, 7, 6, 4, 5, and 8. Now in from the left and right once more is the synchro pair with the white smoke on. They'll be coming down the line again with a closing speed of 700 miles an hour. Red 6 on the right will roll inverted. Red 7 on the left the right way round. As they cross at show centre they'll switch in the vice versa. Six and seven run down the line, the smoke comes off. They'll pitch behind us to position for their next maneuver. Meanwhile, out to the left hand side, here comes Red One with the rest of the formation. They're going to widen, they'll split high and low, then simultaneously roll in revolution. Wait for part two. Yes. 